What's up everyone? I'm Jeffrey at Lightbox and I just got something cool in the mail from Elementor. Look it. They sent me a gift. How dope is that? Oh, I'm really excited about this. You know, I usually binge watch like unpacking and unboxing videos. I'm a super tech head. I love phones and gadgets and stuff like that. I never thought I'd be doing one, but I just got this and I thought, you know what? Let's go ahead and do sort of an unboxing. Let's take a look and see what Elementor sent me. All right, so I don't have any fancy knives because I don't have knives really, but look at it. They even got that Elementor sticker. The details, man, the details. The eye is in the details. I love it. All right, let's see here. All right, I see more Elementor branding, and here we go. Get that focus going. Look at that Elementor stickers. Powered by 10 million. Amazing, right? Wow, okay, check that out right there. Powered by 10 million. Oh, I can't wait to see. Actually, I can't front. You know, I am just opening this right now, but I did see other people posting pictures of it. So I kind of know what it is already. I don't want to front, you know, but uh, I'm excited right now to open this and to get this right here. And I wanted to share it with everyone. So, let's see here. What is this? So, ah, check that out. A cool greeting card right there. Let's get that in focus. More of the details and personalization. Wow, okay. And then it looks like we got a plaque right here. All right, now I've seen this plaque. He's pretty cool. You can put a light behind it. I know my boy Imran, he did something really dope with his. I got to figure out now how I can make mine look dope. Look at, uh, thank you. I'm really, I'm really grateful for this. It's, it's a very generous token. You know, like I got this and I was thinking, what a better time to thank Elementor. They gave a gift, you know, thanking me. I am one of the Elementor leaders inside their community. I've been, I've been, you know, just blessed to be able to be part of the community and connect with people, connect with other people inside Elementor as well. And, you know, really quick, I want to share why I'm such an advocate of Elementor because I have been using Elementor uh full full on for the last three years and I remember the very first time I stumbled across Elementor you know before that I was building websites with with like uh, WP Bakery uh, depending on themes from theme forest or having to custom code things do a lot of custom coding building websites took a while and when I stumbled on Elementor first when I figured out that we could control things like the header and footer and have the flexibility inside forms I was blown away like if you are just starting off right now you have no idea what it used to be like trying to build your own header or your own footer and having that control over it or the control over you know the dynamics with the blog post like these are really powerful tools I think we take them a lot for granted now because they became the norm but it was Elementor that brought them out at least from what I saw, my experience was Elementor, what I saw, Elementor brought this power to building WordPress websites. And it's never been the same since then. But that's not the reason why I am such an advocate of it, because it is just a tool. I have plenty of tools that I use that I've been using for years, but you don't see me creating content or advocating so much for it. The reason why I advocate so much for Elementor is because they have become something much more than a tool. They have built communities. They have a purpose, which is not just to build something to sell it, but they have a genuine purpose to help web creators with their journey, with their business, to help them grow and learn. They have invested so much into their communities, into tools, into resources. And I've got to personally know some amazing people at, in Elementor. I got to know Verde, Tale, Ronnie. And by me getting to know them through you know some time now, their purpose is in line with mine. My purpose is to help web creators find freedom, growth, and to have basically what I have because I love what I do. I have a pretty good living that I've made out of doing it, and I want others to have the same thing. Well, their 
goals, their mission. And when Ben Pines was there, all their missions and everybody that I met with Elements or in Elements, or they all had that same mission. And that is why. That's why I've been such an advocate. Now, I know there's a lot of good tools out there, and I really hope that some of these other creators of some other tools could take a look at what Elementor is doing as far as giving back to the community, building communities, uh, giving out resources, and having a genuine, you know, really genuine interest in helping and to giving back. Because for me, that has been what separated Elementor from everybody else there's a lot of good tools out there elementor is great there's a lot of other great ones but it's the people the culture and the company behind elementor which is why i have become such an advocate of them because we are in line i really like what they do and i hope they continue with and i believe that they will because i know some of the people i know what their what their goals and their focus is and you know it's not to sell stuff it's to help and to give back i love that i love that kind of stuff you know, it's all about giving back. And, you know, the crazy thing is the more you give back, the more that comes in return, the more you teach, the more you learn. It's an amazing journey. Well, anyways, thank you, Elementor. Thank you for listening to my rants. And, yeah, I'll keep pumping out some content, helping out web creators because my goal is to help other web creators have freedom have a sustainable living and be able to have hope and vision and passion and be able to earn a very good living. Well, thank you for listening and I'll be back again with more Elementor and web design related content. Thank you.